When he was just 11 months old, Brian Jackson's father, a phlebotomist, purposely injected Brian with HIV virus with intentions to kill him to avoid paying child support. At five years old, he was diagnosed with AIDS, and doctors told his mother to start making funeral arrangements. Today, at 23 years old, Brian is sharing his message with St. Joseph about his struggles and how he beat the odds. Speaking Sunday morning at Zion United Church of Christ, Brian talked about his struggles in school with bullying and being an outcast, overcoming many obstacles so he could share his story. I've had to overcome bullying at school. Um, there was verbal abuse to physical abuse. Uh, I was left out of birthday parties and social events. I realized that uh, suffering produces perseverance, and perseverance produces character, and character produces hope. Um, so all the suffering that we go through in life is to build the character of who we need to become, the unique individual we're called to be. And through that, we find hope in that. I realized it's not about what you can get in life, it's about what you can give. And I saw that I had a past that I can turn into a testimony. And that testimony can become my story and I can offer that story of hope to somebody out there who needs to hear it more than I do. Brian is thinking of pursuing a career in politics, saying his ultimate goal is to be a voice for the voiceless. His father, who injected him with HIV, is currently serving life in prison for that crime. Adam Waltz, Fox 26, KNPN.